What is up mga higala? Ako na po din si Chris B and for this video mga higala, I will show you on how to set up your TP-Link router. But before that, let's roll the intro. Alright, so since some of my viewers asked me about my previous video on how I extended my internet connection using a TP-Link router, so they asked me to make a detailed video on how to set it up. Actually, napakadali siya, napakadali iset up mga higala. So this is going to be a quick tutorial. Okay, so let's start by connecting our ethernet cable. As you can see here, this is my PLDT router. So it has four LAN ports at the back. So we will be uh, connecting our Ethernet cable from LAN port number one. Kasi nga, yung ibang router hindi activated yung LAN 2, 3, and 4. So yung LAN 1 lang yung nagagamit if you have a PLDT router. So to make sure, let's uh, connect it to LAN 1. And then after you connect your connected your cable to LAN port 1 sa PLDT router mo, ilalagay natin dito sa one port WAN port ng TP-Link router natin so this is the input port para malagyan ng internet connection yung router natin so from LAN port 1 ng PLDT router natin to one port uh, input port ng TP-Link natin Okay, now that we have connected our PLDT router and the TP-Link router together, it's time for us to set it up. And also, we will be using our mobile phone to set up our uh, TP-Link router. Make sure that your mobile phone Wi-Fi is connected to your TP-Link router. So after you uh, put a cable on it, after you set it up, you can immediately access your TP-Link router. Kasi wala siyang password. That's why we are going to set it up. So there are two ways to do this. One way is we will go to Play Store and we will search for TP-Link. So this one, we will look for TP-Link Tether. So after you download it, uh, we, we will open it, okay? So again, if you are connected to your TP-Link router, uh, you can find your router here. So My Devices. And the other way is we will use, you can use a browser, Google, Google Chrome browser. Make sure you only use Google Chrome. We will type 192.168.0.1. Then press enter. It's still the, it's the same as the app. But in here, uh, when you put it, uh, when you, uh, want to access it on your browser first it will ask you uh, to input an email or something like that so I, I kind of forgot but uh, yes this one I already set up mine so that's why it it's asking me my password okay so but now I'm, I'm gonna show you on how to use the app okay let's look for my app okay here it is so after you find your device you click it let's wait for it to load So this is much uh, easier and it's more convenient using the app than using the browser to set it up. So it's here. So the name of my, uh, I already set up mine. So the name of my TP-Link router is Crisby TP-Link. So what we need to do is let's uh, go to tools below Dito. And then we will click quick set. So now that we are here, so you will be uh, selecting a connection type. So if you don't know what your connection type is, you can just click auto detect. So after clicking auto, auto detect, may ilalagay dito connection type dynamic IP. So you will click dynamic IP or if static IP yung nakalagay, you will click static IP. Okay. In my case, it's dynamic IP. Now let's go. Let's click next. So in here, do not change MAC address. So recommended. So uh, ito yung pinili ko. Next. So this is uh, the important part. SSID. So this will be 
the name of your router so in my case I want to put it as crispy PP link okay and then I will set up my password so uh, Ano lang to? Example lang to. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Okay. After that, you click next. So very important to take note of your password so that you can access your router and your Wi-Fi. We click next. Okay. So ito na. Uh, this is a summary of your setup. Dynamic IP, the, the SSID, and the password. And you click apply. When you click apply, so I'm not going to click apply because it will change my password and I'm, it's going to disconnect me from my internet connection. So after you click apply, you will be disconnected to your internet connection kasi mag -re restart yung router mo because you just set it up, you put a password on it and a uh, SSID name. So that's it. Napakadali. Very easy to set up your TP-Link router. So that's it my gala, ganun lang kadali is set up yung TP-Link router mo. I hope you find this video helpful and informative and if you do, please do consider subscribing to my channel so that I can make more of these informative videos. Thank you again and I will see you on my next vlog. Bye-bye.